Hello and welcome back to the Pokemon Y Nuzlocke Challenge. In the last episode, we made our way to this here town, had a look in the castle, and was told to go to Route 7. Well, we weren't told to go to Route 7. That was just what we, uh, that's just what we're planning to do. So anyway, yeah, that's, that's basically the objective for this episode, is to go to Route 7. It's amazing. Hey there. Shub Dooba Dooba Castle must look pretty different to you than it does to me. We're all different people. What? Do you, do you perceive things differently? If you look at this castle, you'll be like, Wow, what a wonderful boat over there. No, that's not how it works, man. We see it the same, alright? Oh, it's the Riviere Walk. I like how all these routes have kind of like their own names. It's, uh, that's pretty cool. No, don't save the game, no. We're not doing that now. We're not doing that now. We're not doing that now. We are, however, trying to train up Bugs, who is for some reason going to be an ass to train. Oh, oh, okay. Uh, I, I didn't mean to... Hey, what's up? What's going on? Hey. Hey, mister, this way, this way. You! I know this is an unexpected request, but I need you to take care of my berry field. What? Berries are great. One berry can produce more berries. I assure that you'll love field work. Ah, uh, no, 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 no. Oh, really? I, I don't even get an option. Okay, come on. Don't know. Really? Well, I know I... Okay, so we get to grow berries in this game. That's cool, at least, but, uh... I... 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 I I'm, 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 I, I can't even speak. Sprinklotad. Sprinklotad. Yes. Way better than a Wilmer Pale. Wilmer Pale? Is that what it's called? Sprinklotad. I got one of those now. Not really sure what it was called in the Generation 2 games, but uh, way better than a Wilmer Pale. Oh, oh, hey. Hey, what's, the, what's going on there? First off, we have to check what's up here. Oh, what the fuck? Uh, hey. Hey. Champion, they said they were going this way. Really? I, explore. I want to explore. Let me explore, damn you. Okay, never mind then. I guess we'll go see what they're doing. What's up, guys? I, um, yeah, it's definitely a Snorlax. Here we go again. It's sleeping so soundly, the end of the world wouldn't wake it. Look, it's practically a mountain, right? It's blocking the road completely. Come now, sir, use the polka flute. Oh wait, do you even have it anymore? Nope, hand it over. Or you could say it was taken by the owner of the palace. Huh? What? What's a polka flute? Basically, the polka flute is what need it's needed to wake up Snorlax, but the polka flute is currently in some sort of palace. Oh, that's it. All we need to do is go and get it then. Come on, champion, let's go. It's just Pat Roos I was going that way! Damn it. Okay, so I guess that's blocked off. Are you coming, Sean? Shauna, whatever your name is? Shauna, are you coming? I guess not. Can I, like, catch a Pokemon? That'd be great. Oh, look at this. Oh, this looks cool. I like this a lot. Can I battle you? It's, uh, okay. I guess no. Alright, that's cool. I want to go and... Can I, like... I'm sure I can catch a Pokemon in here. If I can't catch a Pokemon in here, then... I can't even go in. Damn it. Oh, wow. Alright, I guess we'll just uh, see what you're doing. Oh, you're a trainer. I bet, you <laughs> I bet you thought I was just some unassuming tourist. I happen to be a seasoned battler too. Alright, let's see how let's how, see how seasoned you are. Oh, you are a tourist. Oh, they have tourists in this game. That's cool. I guess it'll make sense because, uh, you know, it's a pretty desirable area. I guess tourists would be coming here to check it out, see what's up. Alright, so level 11, not bad. I'm gonna mud slap you. Because, uh, that should do decent damage. I'm not sure if Mudslap is physical. It probably is, so my attack's gonna fall, and that's kind of suckish. See how much this does. That does, like, nothing. Okay. Alright, never mind. We're switching out. We're pulling out. We're pulling out. Um, we're gonna go into Combuskin real quick, just to take this thing down. And we should be good. I realize that, mo like, most of my Pokemon are, like, way over-leveled for this. But fuck it, it doesn't matter. So we just stop doing that? Combuskin, don't play with that Pikachu! That Pikachu is the enemy. We need to kill Pikachu, alright? Not my Pikachu, though. Don't don't kill my Pikachu. That would be kind of awkward. Uh, just Ember this thing. Alright, good. There we go. That's what I was hoping for. That's what I was looking for. Some nice experience right there. Level 14, not bad. I just wish I knew when um it would evolve. And now Songbird's gonna evolve, so uh, there you go. That's good. You have three Pokemon, though. Psyduck, okay. Alright, well, Sparky hasn't had action in a long time, so I'm gonna I'm gonna let Sparky deal with this one. Go, Sparky! You should be able to take this out pretty easily anyway, so... 
What up, Psyduck? You're gonna be killed. Oh, the weather disappeared. What weather was there? I don't believe there was any weather. I don't know why I'm talking like that either. Oh dear. Oh, and a water gun. Wow, did, did that water gun come out of his nose? That's ridiculous. Oh no, I didn't mean to do that. Oh god. Stop playing with the enemy, Pikachu. Damn it, what side are you on? I mean, I know I told you to do that kind of, sort of, but, uh, you know. If I say do that, d don't, don't do it, alright? Just don't do it. We don't play with the enemy. We attack the enemy. That's what we do. Anyway, Sadek is down. We got 150 experience points, we get a level up. Always nice to see. And everyone else gets levels up, apparently. So cool, that's pretty nice. Pidgey is the last Pokemon, I'm just gonna keep Sparky in. Our Pidgey is gonna evolve at the end of this battle anyway, so that's cool. That's nice to see. Well, I'll give a Thudder Shock to you, that should take you on one hit, right? There you go! You got those one-hitter quitters coming in now. The one-hitter quitters have returned. Alright. What? And some monies, nice. Well, Mr. Un Ooh, sorry, <laughs> Mrs. Unassuming Terrorist, you got fucked. Anyway, our Pokemon's evolving now, so... And there is Pidgeotto. Look at you. Look at you looking majestic as hell. You gonna learn anything? No, you're not gonna learn any moves. Damn it. I was hoping for a wing attack. I guess you're gonna battle me as well then, right? Of course you are. Why do I travel? Why do I battle? Allow me to demonstrate. Alright, that's cool, I guess. How many Pokemon do you have? You have three as well. You like the you like the triple Pokemon twins. That's that's not real no, no, you're not like that at all. <laughs> Just ignore me. Just ignore me. I'm not here. I'm not here. My Baneel Billy Billy is though. And you're gonna get double slapped, so there you go. Alright, that's not bad. Oh, that was a critical. Never mind. I was like, yes, we finally got some decent attack. Nope. Nope. Not at all. Damn it. I don't want to see your ass, Zigzagoon. Right. Just, just stay. Just stay turned around, alright? Oh, you're avoiding me now? Come on. <laughs> what was that? What kind of tackle animation was that? You know, that reminds me of the, uh, really? You missed again. Oh, come on. Seriously? I'm gonna have to s You can't even take down a Zigzagoon. What? What do I- what do I pay you for, Benilibi? What do I pay you for? Come on, I pay you in one of those, you know, those little poke cakes that I was giving you before. That's what I pay you in. What's this? Oh, you lower my attack. Well, no, that's not as bad. That's not as bad. I'm just gonna bubble you. So, we get, actually get to see War Turtle in battle now, so... That's cool. That's nice. Very good. And we get a level up, which is also very nice. So there you go. Alright, nice. I, I say nice too much. Oh, Ralt is coming in. We haven't seen a Ralt so far. I'm gonna send in Sonic because we have the bite. We have the biting power, so... That's probably gonna be pretty helpful here. So let's see what you can do, Ralt. You're level 11. That's, uh, that's pretty bad. That's pretty pitiful. I'm gonna bite the hell out of you. And uh, should take you... Oh no, you're Fairy-type now! Oh, that's right, you're Fairy-type. So bite is actually neutral damage. I I'm never gonna be able to remember that. I will never ever remember that. Oh, that's 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 fucked me up. That is royally fucked me up right here. Damn, that sucks. Um, I probably should have sent in the bunny thing. I should probably should have sent in Bugs Bunny for this one because Mud Slap is super effective. Unless it's fucking Fairy type now. Actually, I think um, I think Ground is neutral against Fairy, so it would still be super effective. Oh, and that did about half. That's just nice. You're gonna yawn me, so I'm probably gonna fall asleep now. Oh, dearie me. Oh, dearie D. We'll bubble you again, and hopefully, since the ba match is gonna end, we might not fall asleep, so... Let's hope. Here's hoping, here's hoping. Come on, come on. Don't fall asleep, don't fall asleep. Combustica grew up another level. So did Bugs. We're all growing up levels. Oh, you wanna learn Takedown? That's actually a decent move, so... Yeah, I'm gonna get rid of Agility. We don't really need Agility that much. I never use Agility, like, ever. I don't think I've ever used agility in my entire Pokemon training career, so there's that. <laughs> um, but yeah, I think we're gonna progress along here. Look at this. Let me just skating away. Not a care in the world. Oh, okay. I can just stop skating for like no reason. Okay, am I gonna have to battle you guys? 
Hey, trainer! Yes, you there, young man. I'll share an orange berry with you. Wow, thanks. I guess. That's pretty nice of you, actually. There is an item over here. Here. There's an ether over here. That'll be late. That'll be useful later on in the game, but uh, right now, I'm not too, not too fussed about using it. Tch, are old buildings more important than people who are alive now? Wow, okay. Okay, you just got, you just forced some moral shit on me right there. I'm not prepared for facing all these hard questions when I'm playing Pokemon, alright? I wonder how much money it takes to build a palace like that. At least two. At least two currency. At, at least. Like, maybe three. The entrance fee will be 1,000 Pokebucks per person. You've got to be kidding. It costs money to go inside? You see, the owner of the palace follows a school of thought that you can never have too much money. I agree with him. Yeesh, this is how the rich get richer. Here's your entrance fee. Damn it. Do I have to pay as well? Hey, hey, Sh Shauna, Shauna, pay me in. Pay me in, damn it. So what if you do have enough money, you just can't get in? <laughs> just like, nope, sorry. The game ends here if you don't have enough money. Wow. That's, that is harsh. That is harsh, Game Freak. Why would you do that? Alright, so I guess we're going into the palace then. Fuck you very much, Mr. Butler. Fuck you very much. These doors are absolutely humongous. I love it. Look at them. Like, like over twice the size of me. That's ridiculous. Ridiculous doors. What is it? Where is it? Where could it be? Is that my low tick? Oh, that's pretty cool. I like those statues. My Furfu! My beloved Furfro! Furfro? Furfro. Yeah, Furfro. It disappeared? Hey, champion! We should help look! I mean, if I... If my Pokemon were missing, I'd be sick with worry! Alright, what's up, man? My beloved Furfro is... Furfro. Yes. <laughs> Past this door is the pride and joy of the palace, the too vast courtyard. You can see the whole garden from the balcony on the second floor. Oh, that's simply delightful. I'm a traveling minstrel rounding the world. Please listen to my song and hear my words. Um, oh god, I'm not singing, no. Would you like to give a tip? Nope, sorry. We don't tip. We don't tip here in Kalos. Oh, I'm such an ass. Sorry. Um, what's in here? I guess we have to look, locate this fur for hour or something. Ooh, some wonderful paintings. The glorious past. The brilliant future. Why, I cannot wait to experience both of them, even though the past has already been... So, I, I guess you can't really experience that, so... There goes my plans. Hey there! I feel like I'm in a dream. Yep, you're in a dream that cost a thousand Pokebucks to get in. How do you feel? How do you feel? You just go home and dream it normally, but nope, you have to pay for this one. Or, uh, yeah, oh, every meal is a feast. This owner sounds kind of fat. Not that, not that I have a problem with this, but you know... Sometimes you just eat too much and, uh, you feel sick. So, uh, that's probably... It's probably pretty sick, huh? You're eating too much. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. I'm just trying to locate this fur frow. Oh, hey, what is this? Hey, what's going on? Oh, is this the balcony? I guess this- Oh, this place is huge. This place is absolutely ginormous. Wow, that's that's really something. This place is some- This is- I think this is, like, bigger than some of the cities. Like, you can't have a- You can't have a mansion bigger than a city. That doesn't make sense. Damn it, Game Freak. Long ago, the king and his Pokemon would enjoy their meals at this table. Really? The Pokemon too? It's kind of odd. Or it was like a Rhydon, he's like sitting on the chair, he'd probably break it actually. Oh, what's this? An amulet coin! You guys don't mind if I take this, right? Yeah, of course you don't. No one has to know, Mr. Butler. I hear that a forbidden tome once existed that contained the secret to bringing Pokemon back to life. It's probably just rumor, though. We've certainly got nothing of that sort in our library. That's a pretty cool idea, actually. Bringing Pokemon back to life. Poor, uh, poor Cubone's mother. We could, uh, we could finally reunite them. We could reunite them. And it'll be amazing. How many bedrooms does this guy want? We have to locate a stupid Pokemon. Oh, where is it? Where is Where could it be? Where could it boo? Eh, it's not here. Damn it, I'm, I'm gonna have to, like, search this entire thing. Am I not to be, like... I'm, I'm sure I'm supposed to be, like, finding the owner here. Unless that is the owner. That would make sense. If that guy's the owner and he's like, Oh, you found my... What of a Jabida. You can have this... What of a Yeah, that would make sense. I, I, I would get that. I would understand that. But, uh... I'm pretty lost right now. 
I have like no idea. I mean, there's only a limited number of rooms it could be in. There's the, there's the moral. Man, what's a moral? A moral? I'm pretty sure I've like checked all these rooms, right? I must have skipped some rooms. See, I don't like these kind of things where it's just like, you know what? Just, just go and fucking do it, man. I'm not gonna give you any clues. Just, just fucking do it. I mean, I, I know that's how like old school games were. They're just like not giving you any help or anything like that. But uh, it is kind of, it takes a while, and it's especially. It's especially tedious for when you're recording because, uh, <laughs> you have to think of things- Oh, whoa, what's going on here? Hello! It's the king who built the palace, maybe. Maybe it was. Maybe it was, maybe it woos. Ah, uh, oh, damn it, I can't find this fucking thing. Um, Furfow, you wanna come out now? No. You wanna come out now, that'd be great. You had to go and lose your stupid Pokemon, didn't you? Do you know where this thing was? No. Oh, they were used as sentries, huh? I bet that's pretty interesting. I bet that's pretty interesting. I'm going back along here now. I don't know where I'm going. I'm lost. I'm so very, very lost. Okay. You know what? Let's. Uh, I'm. I'm gonna have a little check downstairs. Um. I, I'm pretty sure we've already been here, and then we'll go back to where we started, I guess. Um. Oh, wait, hello, what's going on here? Oh, wait, can I actually go in here? Don't tell me it was out here the whole time. I, I thought it was gonna be, like, blocked to- Oh, this is looking cool. Is that Golark? Hey there, Golark, how's it going? Oh, of course, now we- Oh, wait, no. I'll have a look in the back. Sure you will, sure you will. Can I roll skate around here now? No, I can't. Why can't I roll skate around the courtyards? Worst game ever- Oh, look at this. You've got the top-down view going now. Okay, what's this? An antidote? All right. Uh, that's not bad, that's not bad. I guess it's just kind of like a maze thing. Or they're trying to make it like a maze, I don't know. I need to find this damn furfew. Furfow. There's an item here. Oh, a revive! Wow, I'm so glad I got this revive. Oh, dearie me. Oh, dearie dump. Oh, dearie Lee. Can we find this thing? I don't know if I'm like... Wait, are you saying you're looking in the back? Okay, if you're looking in the back, I'm gonna come and help you. Oh, is that a Zekrom? It is a Zekrom. Well, we got the 5 gen... The 5th gen legendaries here, we don't need those anymore. We got, we got 6th gen now. We're in 6th gen now, we don't need those 5th gen shit. We don't need any of that. But, um, yeah, I'm trying to find this thing. I'm not sh I'm not exactly sure if it's supposed to be out here. It's a palace among palaces. A king among- Oh, there you are, you son of a bitch, come here. I swear to don't you dare run away. You fucker, you little fucker, come back here right now. Please don't run away. Champion, give me a hand! Oh, Jesus Christ, okay. Where did it go? Okay, what kind of- Ugh, oh, really? I'll keep it from getting away, so pick a spot for me to stand. Somewhere like... Over there? Over there? Okay, um... We can solve the puzzle? Oh, Christ, there's a puzzle! Well, <laughs> that's it for this episode. When we come back, we're gonna solve the fucking puzzle. I love puzzles. So I'm going to thank you all very much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.